So, all right, bear trap. Oh. oh, no. Oh, God. We can't hurt ourselves with it. No, and we're stuck. Oh, for real? It is your friendly neighborhood slipgator here coming in for a landing doing stuff and things playing more arc survival evolved peeps hope you guys are having a good day i'm having a great day i just got back from doing a little uh leveling up on foul mouth he's at 166 now pumped him up to 697 percent melee damage and 105 gave him a little bit of speed but that's it so got him leveled up actually my brother and i both i think i said in the last video we both lost our rgs and then um i went out this morning and helped him get another one so he's got another guy over there too give me some water yo but yeah we're back doing stuff and things at the base i'm excited to be here you know what i think we need to do we need an upgrade you know i we started talking about this base we said we're gonna do it out of metal and i think that that was like really bad idea um it took so much amazing amount of resources to do this metal floor. I'm giving up, peeps. I'm not doing it. I just will not do it. So what I think we're going to do is get on to getting some stone walls going here. So um, let's go ahead and take a look at our... Oh, wait, no. What do we got? Craftables inside of here. Structures. Stone. Up in this piece. We need some stone walls. Stone, wood, thatch. So what we can do, actually... You know what's really cool? Everything in one chest now. Grab a couple thatch, a couple hundred, uh, like so. And then we'll just squirt a bunch of wood in here. Or stone, I said. And we'll start getting some stone walls made. I want to at least get this thing converted. And I think what we're going to work on as well. Oh, we're full. Is also, there's 13. We're going to work on maybe a little bit of electricity. And then also, I think we need a couple of towers. I want to get some, like, different building. Right so far, we've been building, like, boxes. It's not very slipgatery. If you guys watch my Minecraft stuff, we normally do stuff that's a little bit more intense. Kind of, kind of super intense. So I'm thinking that's what we're going to do today. Maybe get a couple of towers knocked out as well. So a bunch of going to craft up a huge amount of walls. Maybe some ceilings. I don't know. I'm, we, maybe go crazy. Maybe make a pillar. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll be our beast, peeps. And we're back from yet another run of getting stuff and things. Let's go ahead and start pulling some of the stuff out. You know, what? I was with the new vaults. I got to tell you guys, having the vault thing is like so amazing. It's so nice to just be able to drop everything inside of one container. Like... I understand, and I talked about it when I built them, that these vaults aren't really space like any more space efficient than using the regular large storage, but being able to just drop everything in one spot, unbelievably helpful. Look at that. And it's really not that tough to organize either. You can see I've got tons and tons of stone. I've been getting huge amounts of stuff. I want extra of everything. And I already did a huge amount of crafting too. We've got 112 walls, 97 ceilings. Do we have any po stone pillars? I need. I have seven. I want to redo all the pillars down here, too. It's going to be a huge day, a long day, a lot of base improvement. And the one thing I actually want to bust out first is I do want to do the pillars first. The reason is, is there's a possibility that things will fall down when we <laughs> replace the pillars. It shouldn't happen. It shouldn't happen. But it might. So craftables, what do we need for pillars? Stone, wood, thatch. Easy, peasy, lemon squeezy. Now check it out. So you just grab a your, couple of your favorite stacks of wood, grab a couple of your favorite stacks of thatch, put some stone in here like so, like one of these, one of those, one of those, one of them. And then you go into here like this, bam, 12! We're doing it, peeps! So I tell you what, I think we're gonna do to make this super exciting. I think we're gonna do a building montage, peeps. Check it out! And we're back. We got some building.
thing done, peeps? Kind of, sort of. Couple hitches. There's one right there. You can see my my thing. My building's got a, like a little tooth. Hold on. Let's pop back here. Back it up. Beep, beep, beep. All right, we got this. Check it out. Peace out, stone wall. Nail the day that can't be stopped. So yeah, I hope you guys like the montage. Make sure if you do, you hit the thumbs up button to show your support for special stuff and things like that. But over here, ran into the same problem that we had over uh, in the other part of the house over here. We can't put any, we can't exchange these guys out. Now I want to keep all the windows wood because I think it just looks better. On the other side, you can see, we'll run over here real quick just so you can see how it looks. And I think it looks great. Everything on this side is looking fine. And we should have really done this upgrade before we put in our, our uh, vaults. But check it out. I took out a couple of the little storage things I had over here. So I thought they might be hitting. I mean, look, our, our smithy here is not touching. And if you look behind the wall here, you can see these vaults are not touching. Um, over here, too, uh, I think maybe the refining forges might... I don't know. They don't seem to be touching or, or clipping. Then back behind there, it's hard to see, but they look like they're good to go, but I cannot do anything here. So um, I'm thinking it might actually be the floors. I don't know exactly what's going on there. Um, also, sometime, or last time people asked if these guys were damaged, all these walls are at uh, 10,000, 10,000, so they're not damaged. Um, they're good to go there. But we got it all done other than that, and I'll work on that maybe later. Um, and then I came up here, we did all the ceilings, then we added a wall all the way around the top here. And we're pretty close to out of resources, but I started playing around with trying to do a tower. Now again, super difficult to do this. Now what I decided to do was try to build, you can see here, this is on the middle. Like this, this post on the wall is the center point of the block, so to speak, right? So you can see like this right there is the stone ceiling. This is the wood wall. That's the center of it. This is the other one. So I actually placed a fence foundation in the middle and you can do that. It's kind of hard to see. Let me see if I can show you. It'll, right there. See, it'll snap to the center point between two pieces. And so that's cool. It's like, oh, that's really neat. I can make like a tower in the center. But what ends up, once it ends up happening is that it's super hard to get, oh, my out of fence foundations? To get them to snap to the edges, like to make a fence foundation from this point to this point here, it's like near impossible. I've been trying to do it for about 10 minutes. And I just can't. So, and the reason I wanted to do the tower like this because it would be in the center. And I was like, oh, that'll look good, you know. That'll be sweet. It'll be in the center. It'll be amazing, cool, center -y type deal. So what I think we're going to actually do is demolish this. And we're going to do something with stone pillars instead. I have a couple of those left. And I think it'll still be pretty cool. I want to, can we get these fence foundations out of here too? Yeah, I'm going to pop these out. And I've been throwing stuff away. A lot of stuff. Wood especially. Really don't need thatch and fiber now. We're like maxed out on that stuff in storage. You might have seen in the montage. We just started throwing some of it away because we have so much. We're all full in there. So, all right. Fence foundations be gone. I'm going to play around with it like I was saying. I'm just going to do it off camera and see what I can kind of construct and see how it looks. But, yeah. All right. I'm going to play around with it. Now, BRBs, peep. And we're back, and I got some stuff and things done. I got a lot of stuff and things done. It took a lot of placing of things, but I made a two-by-two two that actually has all the inside on the inside and all the outside on the outside. It's the most amazing thing ever. And I just want to let you guys know, you think this is easy. It is not. It is really super difficult. It's really hard to place stuff in this game. Uh, really, really tough, but check it out. So this is what I decided to go with. It's a little resource intensive, but hey, whatever. We're having a good time doing it. So we got our little platform up here. We're going to have a little watchtower thing type place. It's going to be unbelievable. So we got that one there. And then I started one over here too. Now they're, I think, one block off. Like as far as, if you can see, the hangar is one block to the right of this building. Um, and that was basically so that I, just so you know, I wonder how much damage I take if I fall down. Oh, let's find out! <laughs> Oh, what's well, minor, man? But the reason that those are off like that, climb, is so that the center, it's centered on this doorway. That's why. So it's a little bit off. So the two towers are going to be a little bit off. But hey, it's a thing. So I think I've got, do I have any walls left? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm out of walls. I have nine walls. All right, we can grab these guys and then maybe head up to the top of the tower, one of the towers. So we're have two little lookout towers. I think this is going to add something. It's going to look cool, you know? So if we come up here, let's see if we can make another, the top of this thing. So you can kind of see what it's going to look like. Let me see here. So this guy would be like this. And then 
Oh, we got an inside. Oh, we made it an outside. All right, so see, this is what you go through. Demolish it. Wait, wait for it. No, that's an inside. Nailed it, Ace, it can't be stopped. That's an inside, I think. That's an outside. Crap, no, wrong, incorrect. Outside. Inside. Nailed it! Oh, outside. See, that one looked like an inside, but it was an outside. I'm really kind of, like, super frustrated with building in this game. There, we got it. Oh, wait, no, that was an inside. It looked like an outside. Why? All right, one more time. Let's build an outside, and maybe the outside will be an inside. No, we can't win! We'll have to, I'll have to figure it out. All right. And actually, I don't... Now that I built these walls here... Oh, crap. I'm not sure if we want walls. We'll just jump off. It's super foggy and rainy, and the video is awful right now. But um, I'm not sure if we're going to want walls there. We might want windows. Now that I think about it. Well, anyway, that's the update. Oh, also, I want to show you guys this, too. Some other little uh, pain points with building here. It looks like some of these foundations have popped up through. And that's kind of my own fault, I think. Um, I think because of building the double floor and doing all that, it's caused there to be a little bit of an issue. And that really kind of stinks. But it is what it is. And there's not really a way I can fix it without destroying a lot of flooring. So I'm just going to leave it the way it is. It's a nice little piece. It's a little aesthetic. Awesome stuff. And then I also had... Yeah, let's do it. Let's convince ourselves. It's awesome. I also added stone flooring all the way in here, too, to make this all even now, which is really rad. I like that a lot. I think it's pretty cool. So, all right, cool. We did some building. I got to go, I think, just do crafting. I'm pretty sure we still have some, have some materials. So we're going to craft up some stuff and things, and then I will BRBs, peeps. And we're back, and stuff and things are starting to look like stuff and things are happening. Stuff and things are happening, peeps. Let me show you what's going on inside of here. You know, I think that we're not going to get two of these done in a single day. It's just too much, um, having done the whole base as well today. So, but yeah, I think we can get one of them done at least. But I wanted to show you what I was doing here. So you can make little fences like this. It is a thing. It is possible. It's very much a pain in the butt. I'll show you how you do it. One fence, two, three, four. We're going to do 15, I think. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Place them all like so. Then you just go down inside of here, and you have to demolish the 14 underneath it. And it's very simple, and it becomes a fence. It's very easy. This is kind of cool. You know, this is really, it is kind of neat. Like, it's kind of a pain in the butt they have to do stuff like this, but at the same time, it's kind of fun to work the system, so to speak, so that you can get stuff and things done. You know what I mean? Like, it's just kind of fun. You got to make sure you don't select the top one ever. That is that is the worst. Let's actually tear down. Oh, 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 let's tear this one. Oh, I think that's the lower one. If you do the top one, it's all over. So now we got two. There, we got it. We got it. Nailed it. It can't be stopped. Did we get it? Is that the last one? All right, cool. And we got these ones down here we got to do. Now... If we leave the bottom most one... Okay, there's two more down there, actually. Let me pop off of here so you can see. It actually leaves a little... Like, you can see if we leave that bottom one as kind of a rail, it leaves these little pieces sticking out underneath. So we don't really want those, so we're going to tear those down. But I think, you know what I need? We need a break from building. They added something new to the game, and I want to check it out. So let's go ahead into our Ingrams here, and let's head down. There's a new bear trap that i heard about and i think it's in this update let's take a look and see what we got we gotta play the metal spike walls too i saw those there it is bear trap right there oh this is the large bear trap we need the regular bear trap regular bear trap learn engram large bear trap learn engram let's do it these are crafted in the smithy so when i was playing the other day i did some streaming and I actually went to one of the uh, pvp servers do i have any room for this stuff oh sweet i got more room now um, and when I was on the PvP servers, I lost my train of thought. What did I learn when I was there? Oh, no, what? Crapped in the thing. So, anyway, I was on there. We were doing it in the stream. If you guys don't follow me on uh, Twitch, twitch.tv slash Slipgator. And um, we had a really, really good time over there. I can't, I wish, I'm sorry I lost my train of thought. I can't remember what I was going to tell you guys about what we did. Can I access this? All right. So, weapons? Um, uh, melee? No. What would it be under? Structures? Metal? No. Defenses? Bear trap. We need fiber. All right. Do we get any fiber squirted over in here? Now that squirt that in there, suck it into this. Pfft. Did it. Defenses? Bear trap. Make one. Large bear trap. Make one of those two. Oh my god. 
All right, so we got our bear trap and a large bear trap. Let's go out here and test it. We got to test it out and see how it works. So let's just put them down on the ground. Bear trap. Looks like a bear's trap, maybe. E to pick up bear trap. Hold for more options. We can pick it up or demolish it. Those are our options. Nine. Oh, my God. Gargantuan. That thing is so BA looking. So, all right, bear trap. Oh, no. Oh, God. We can't hurt ourselves with it. No, and we're stuck. Oh, for real? Oh, we're stuck in a bear trap. Time is stuck in a bear trap. It's got my leg, man. Is there any way to get out of it? How do you... Oh, no way. Ninety-seven out of a hundred. Oh my God. Uh, let me see here. Can we get our pick? No, not place. I thought we hit our ninety-five. Ninety-four. You're kidding me, man. This thing is super powerful. Like, we might not have enough pick to get out of it. Ninety-three. <laughs> I can't believe it, man. I'm not. I don't even know how to know what this thing does. We gotta. We gotta find a dino to test that guy out on. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get out of this bear trap. Or does it just go down? Is it, if we just wait, is it on a timer? I don't think it's a timer. Oh, it is a timer. Okay, okay. So I'm not doing anything to it. It's on a timer. We'll demolish the fence foundation. So we got it on a timer. We're just gonna have to wait. Tiny, just gonna wait. Can we? Is there a way to glitch out of it? Let me see. Can we crouch? You can't crouch or lay down. And I wonder what happens if we log out. I bet that won't get you out of it either. I'm going to take a wild guess. All right. Tiny just going to wait here for the bear trap. <laughs> Two seconds so I can get out of this bear trap. All right, one more second. There's been a lot of seconds. It's been a long time. Okay, and we're back. And it's day, and the bear trap is gone. Couple of things. No, not this. These. Couple of things. You cannot eat or drink while you are bear trapped. That is kind of a big deal. It's something to think about. There's just, you can't do it. So that is a thing. Let us come up here, and what we're going to do next. So that's really interesting. Um, it doesn't really last long enough where you would, like, you know what I mean, starve to death or anything like that. But I was hungry. It did take a while. It was kind of scary. All right. So the next thing we want to see is what happens if we bear trap a dodo oh no wait let's make another bear trap let's go out and make we'll make two or three bear traps and then go out and have some fun with these bear traps all right guys test number one if we aggro one of these guys with a bear trap what bear trap fail does it only work on players it may only work on players I'm assuming the large bear trap would work on large dinos, right? Bear trap. Get bear trapped. Bear trap. Why, you guys are amazing at dodging the bear traps. Oh, no, that was a big battle now. This isn't working out at all. We're not testing our bear traps in any way. All right, let's head over here. There's some dodos. I want a dodo... I want to bear trap a dodo pretty bad. Let's see here. Bear trap. Look at him. <laughs> He's assessing the situation. You guys are so smart. How come you guys are so smart? If I punch you in your face. Come after me. Bring it on. Does he know to walk around? Oh, he's just strutting his stuff in that early direction. Bear trap. He walked right through it! Okay, maybe they don't work on dinos. I thought that they did. Uh, they definitely work on players. But, man, all right, let's try We'll try to. Maybe it needs to be, like, set for a moment or something? I don't know, man. Bear trap. Kill it! Oh, these dodos are so smart. Perhaps the bear traps, the large ones, are only for use on large monsters. This could be the reason why stuff and these are working. Hmm. What? Small bear trap. Why you no be a bear trap? Maybe they only work on bears. He walked right on the sensor. These dodos are amazing. All right, <laughs> enough playing around. It doesn't work on that, I guess.
Nailed it! Aced it! Can't be stopped! So I don't know if they have to be aggressive, if that's the deal, or what the dealio, dealio is. We can only place them so far away from other traps. Oh, no, it doesn't last very long. Oh, they don't last very long at all. Oh, man. All right, that's fine. We can just fly out of here. So they do work, but on dinos, they don't seem to work for very long at all. Oh, look how quick they, they're released. That seems really strange. So on a player, it takes forever, like forever and ever. But on the dinos, it's really, really quick. Um, and then for some reason, I don't know if they need to be placed like in a certain, like out of a certain proximity to then affect the dino. Cause like you were seeing before when I was laying them down, they weren't really, you know what I mean? They weren't activating. But they're cool. They're kind of not useful V dinos. They, yeah, super useful PVP, I would think. But I'm not really sure how they work. I was reading up on the forums a little bit, and some people were saying that when you're bear trapped, you can't be damaged, um, which seems weird. And I don't know if that was correct. You know the internet; you can't trust everything that you read. But all right, so we played around with bear traps. It was pretty cool. I like bear traps. They're fun. I really wish they worked better against dinos. That would be sweet. And we're back. Take a look. We're gonna fly around and take a look. But let's just climb up. Wait, did we just climb up the wrong way? Which way? This is not even the way. Why do we even do this? What were you guys thinking? How come you didn't help me? All right, here we go. Let's come up here and see what we can do. The big reveal! Oh my God! Look at it, peeps. It's a humongous tower. I just was looking down at the clock and realizing it's been a long, long day of doing stuff and things, but it's been rewarding. We kind of got it done. I want to put windows on here and doors and stuff like that too, but I did get these guys done. We have our fence. We can't walk off. We can jump off, but we're not gonna. Yes, we are. Just kidding. All right. So we take, uh, yeah, it's not a, not a little damage there. It's not a bad amount of damage. Let's go ahead and let's have a fly around here. We'll get a little bit of water. And then we'll just take ultimate destroyer. And, oh no, wait, this is an ultimate destroyer. What am I talking about? We'll take foul mouth. Foul mouth, out. Nailed it, aced it, can't be stopped. Let's take a look at what she looks like from afar. Not bad, not bad. Came out pretty good. I kind of like the way that looks. Yeah, maybe could have, oh, I just pooped on it. We could have maybe centered it. I think it's cool that it's forward facing like that. And then when we have the other one behind it, it's gonna look really rad. I like that a lot. That's cool, peeps. If you guys like it, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. A lot of work, a lot of work involved in making something like that. Crazy. So I don't know. We'll get to working on the other ones. I might do some of this stuff off camera. Um, let me go ahead and land in here. And stay. Stay. Don't go anywhere. All right. Let's pop up here, and then we're going to say goodbye, guys. It has been a long, long day of building, and I'm exhausted. I need to go have some dinner. So thank you guys very much for watching. If you guys liked the video... Please don't forget to hit the like button and share your support. Feel free to share and favorite it as you see fit. May the stuff and things be with you. Watch us back into the tower. Peace out, peace.